Hi, I'm Paul Hunt. Um, you, uh, YouTube username Art Paper Show, and I'm here to talk about some artworks that I've been working on with a particular storyline. You can follow me on my YouTube channel, Art Paper Show. Um, I've been working on some art projects with Alan Shercliffe, which um, you can follow him on his Twitter account at Star Wars Fan, or you can also subscribe to his YouTube channel. Alan Varutu Galax, which is A L L E N space V E R A T U space G L A X. And uh, that's to get some more information about what's going on with the art projects that we're working on and stuff like that. So, without further ado, I'll explain um, some of the uh, art projects and stuff like that and in the intro it's made was a, a golden age of star piloting era senate of the united republic and the ch chancellor emperor of the chamber before they moved to the puppet president system the artwork contains the logos of the Malcolm Sturb Industries Alliance uh, and the United Republic logo. So without further ado, I will talk about um, the artwork. And here it goes. Since January 6, 2021, there was the idea of the Malmind Cyberzerker being a combination of a battle droid by the way they are commanded by a central computer like the droids in Episode 1 of Star Wars, Borg by them being the simulated human beings, Cylons by the way they attack in mass and uh, alien from Stargate SG-1 like. Yahtzee Crawshaw has a book out called We Will Save the, Un uh, Save the Galaxy for F Food, which contains uh, the idea of Malcolm Sturb's creation of Malmine Cyberzerker. He doesn't have an exact image of the Malmine Cyberzerker though. It would be good if Yahtzee Crawshaw released an artwork that contained an image of the Cyberzerker. So uh, I did a painting that might kind of display that idea um, of what the Cyberzerker may look like with the shield and the, the axe and them being like the uh, Borg, Cylons, alien-like in a humanoid face as well. Um, that kind of gives the introduction of my art projects of what happens that uh, would include a cyberzerker in the art projects as the main uh, warriors behind the project. So uh, that's kind of what's going on there. On to the next painting. Painting two, this is the Malmine Cyberzerker ship and the Cyberzerker transport it and has a ship with a cockpit and which rules out Star Wars in that sense because of the vulture droids uh, and the ships that of that in that franchise uh, in its in that sense. And it's also Borg-like. So it's basically what these Cyberzerkers are using uh, as a transported themselves uh, to get from a colony to colony, planet to planet, uh, to set up their own colonizations uh, and uh, defense mechanisms as well. Um, and also it has the energy drink logo right there. Uh, 
that I'll explain uh, in further down in the paintings that I'm talking about in my storyline. The next painting. This is the Confederacy of Independent Systems Council. And these are the member faucet of the Malcolm Sturb Industries Alliance. So these are the members that take place. And this is a planet concept art for the planet of the United Republic, which sounds like a mix of the Galactic Republic pre-Empire and the Federation of Planets. Uh, that would basically be like Federation of Planets and Star Trek, like uh, also aliens to run this. So you have the aliens uh, right there in a sense that uh, run the Sturb uh, Industries Alliance because Malcolm Sturb in a sense um, this is the idea of you know of, uh, this uh, what he came up with in the, the Mal mind and um, what he used and come up with the Mal mind in a sense and uh, some also that evolve with these organizations right here are uh, the Trade Federation, Techno Union Army, Banking Clan, Genosians, and other alien races from, basically there would be like alien races, kind of like from Star Wars, Star Trek, like that. And there's the uh, energy drink logo uh, that I'm gonna talk about in the next, in a few minutes in the videos. And yeah, uh, this is the alliances uh, that take place uh, sort of like the council of government. These are the governments um, that take place. Uh, where the cyber zerkers are like the soldiers, sort of like. The, the, that guy, yeah, these are like the soldiers. This is the, uh, this is the Command Drodnet class, Malcolm Sturbs Industries Alliance. Star Drodnet Cruiser. So this is uh, sort of like a transport, not really a battleship, but maybe like a transport ship for uh, this alliance right here. Uh, that helps them uh, be in a transporter to help them govern uh, um, what they will uh, in their uh, universe colonies and uh, colonizations and uh, certain number galaxies and stuff like that. And there's also uh, the, uh, once again, the logo that takes place, uh, which I'm gonna explain in the next uh, few paintings. Um, and uh, yeah, that's uh, this painting right here. Right here we have the Watt Timber, also known as Tandem Drake. And uh, he's the one that is an influencer as the like energy fuel motivator behind fueling everything and giving energy to stuff. And um, as you can see, he has energy pipes right here. And in a sense, a little history behind this guy and other characters uh, that follow um, this system right here is the energy drink idea came from the Zerfrian people seen in the book in which they are drinking energy drinks and you know, the energy drinks that empowered them in a particular kind of way that uh, wouldn't have never done before and they were empowered to do particular things that were never done before uh, like specializations and stuff like that but uh, the name of the organization uh, behind these symbols right here, uh, that er that's the energy powered uh, systems for them, is a Bubble High Caffeine Beverage Association. And also, if you notice, he has uh, sleep lines under his eyes. Uh, that's because of the high uh, amounts of caffeine beverages they drink as well. So that's kind of interesting. And last but not least, these are the um, 
these are the attack cruisers, basically. Massive invasive ships. And these are the ships that are actually um, uh, gonna go through and do battle. Unlike the uh, attack uh, ships right there that the, that are used by the Cyber Zerker, um, the council when um, arranged for these uh, attack cruisers to be used um, in certain kinds of uh, sequences of battle that are, uh, as you can tell, um, have the uh, logo here because they're more higher in velocity uh, for these battles. Well, that's a, a wrap for um, my projects right now. Stay tuned for further projects and further updates and see what kind of paintings uh, we come along with. And keep up to date with both our channels. And till then, um, thank you uh, for listening uh, to this video and uh, take care. Thank you.